This module will briefly demonstrate the new 2013 variable rate functionality in Pioneer's Fit Studio program. The functionality to be covered in this video includes the ability to copy previous years of variable rate seating prescriptions into management zones for use again, the addition of in-class soils to the product search window to assist with product placement, and the ability to create variable rate seating prescriptions by in-class soils. New in 2013, Fit Studio will now allow you to reuse management zones from previously created variable rate seeding prescriptions. The prescriptions can be moved by operation, farm, or field level. If you would like to reuse management zones, first select the level in the domain tree. Next, select Copy VRS to Management Zone in the VRS menu dropdown. Select the source crop year. This should be the year of the previous prescription was created. Next, ensure that the crop to copy is set to either corn or soybeans depending on the previous variable rate seeding prescription you are importing. Finally, create a custom layer name. When finished, press OK. The management zone should appear beneath your farm field or operation level in your domain tree. The next feature is part of the Place Seed Products extension within Pioneer's Fit Studio. To open this extension, select Place Seed Products from your Edit Menu dropdown. The Place Seed Products window will appear on your screen. Next, press the magnifying glass icon to open the product search window. The product search window should appear on your screen. For the selected field in the domain tree, you will see a breakdown of in-class soils classifications. This may be beneficial when searching for certain attributes in a product. The next tool is creating a variable rate seeding prescription by in-class soils. Select the level in the domain tree that you would like to create the variable rate prescription for. The options include the operation level, the farm level, or the individual field level. Notice that a proposed plant appears beneath the corn crop zone underneath our field level. This indicates that a product has been assigned to the field in either Fit Field Planner or Fit Studio's Place Products extension. This is required prior to creating any variable rate seeding prescription. To create a variable rate prescription using our end class soils, right mouse click on the operation, farm, or field level, choose Create a VRS Suggestion, and select From End Class Soils. Select the field and product combination from the list on the left. Then select the Suggest Fields button. Assign seed rates for each in-class soil type, keeping in mind the product that has been suggested for that field. Please note that you can assign different seeding rates to each product and field combination. In this example, it shows that there are two product and field combinations in the fields available to suggest box, one for each product. If I select both rows and use the Suggest All button, then I will generate two prescriptions, one for each product, and we will assign the same seeding rate for both products for each in-class soil type. However, I can also just select one field and product combination at a time. When done, select Assign, and then select another product to begin the Suggest Fields process. Assign different seeding rates if necessary. Select Assign to save the seeding rates for the final product. When all products have been assigned, press the Close button to close your seeding rate assignment window.